welcome back to another episode of City Skylines. So today what we got is some stuff that we need to work on for uh, the uh, actual, um, I believe we have some residential demand so we might be able to start working on this area over here and see if we can't get some housing and stuff set up. I want to redesign the roads just a little bit so we have more room to work in. So we'll be working on that. I'll just wait for this police car to get through, I guess. And uh, once we do that, we'll be able to um, set up the roads a little bit better. So this is just a double road that's going through here. Um, I'm not sure if we have boats unlocked yet. Yes, we do. We have uh, cargo hubs. So we can put that over here, definitely. Or even over here. Uh, we'll have to kind of figure out where we want the connection to be. So we can do it there. There's also passenger import or passenger hub. So we might actually set up, we have all these different directions that we can basically set this up in. Uh, we don't have a lot of space over on this side. Uh, so if we do expand into a cargo route, then we might want to occupy this area for cargo. Uh, reason being we could put the storage and stuff there and it'll be a little bit easier to export um, another thing that we could do is we can you know makes make it a lot better and stuff like that so at the moment what I'm going to focus on is probably the passenger and we'll set that all up we need to fill out some of this area I'm just gonna speed up the time until it turns day so it'll be a little bit easier to see the uh, water and how things are set up around here and then we can start focusing on flattening out the area and stuff like that um, That will make it a little bit easier to build and stuff um, And then we can start laying in the roads and bringing it to the location that we need for the, the housing and stuff like that, too, so I figure we'll continue that line that um, tram line down there and then we can connect that up to the transportation hub uh, or the ferry uh, so we can get people directly onto the tram system now I'm not sure how many there's not that many using it at the moment so
the area, <clears throat> and I am working currently on getting the system set up for road networks and stuff like that. So we needed to get that tram line down here. Oh, we're probably going to go with the one on the sides. What ones with bike lanes too. So tram tracks, bicycle lanes, this is the one we want. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep it closest to the edge like this. And we'll bring it up to probably here. Um, yeah, we'll, br we'll bring it up to there. Uh, we'll need to adjust the thing just a little bit so we can get the tram line to go around. <clears throat> This should help with um, traffic. We can even bring it up to here and then have them directly cross over. Uh, we can go with maybe some tree roads. I'll go like that. And then they can cross directly over that way. And then what we'll go with is... Maybe the trams. Yeah, we'll go like this. Um, yeah, we can probably do that. We'll bring it around um, over here. Do a line like that. And... We could probably get away with doing an opposite line. Maybe a little bit further out. Like that. And then we can go under. Or over. Over would work too. Might need to go down a little bit. Let's see if we can adjust this. That perfect.
area is developing quite well. Um, we have one abandoned building. I put a couple hotels in, um, the, uh, aquarium, which just seemed to be fitting right next to the, um, ferry depot and the actual, uh, harbor for passengers and stuff. So, uh, it's kind of like a kind of business transit area on this part. I put a lot of trees in and put some tourism bu buildings in here. There's also another hotel here. So this one's charging like $27. We could probably raise that up to about 28 maybe. I'm not sure if that will impact too much, but it might give us a little bit more profit. It's already making more than what it requires. So it's perfect for that. Um, and then I've been just kind of filling in these areas for, um, the residential and stuff like that, but we don't have a residential demand at the moment, so, uh, I haven't been able to fill in this entirely just yet, but we'll get there eventually. And might want to set up a bus route, bus line to here as well, just to give people a little bit more options. Uh, I did want to set up a ferry um, area for some of these areas around here. Now, I wanted to eventually get this road over onto this side. Um, we might want to dive into the fishing industry as well. We still yet to have to do that. But um, once we get the ferry lines and stuff set up, I think that will be good uh, to figure out where we're going to be going from there. Uh, for this one though, um, this is a double line. You can probably get that road over to the other side there. I'm not sure if it has... Yeah, it doesn't have bicycle lanes. But... We can definitely fix that right now. And then we'll go over... That uh, could be raised up a little bit, I think. Let's see if we can't um, fix that train. Let's see if we can't get a direct line over to this area.
right, guys. So we got uh, this whole area developed now. I was just waiting for the um, residential demand to go up. So I put some skyscrapers in here as well, just uh, residential ones, uh, some schools and stuff. We, we do need um, more schools for sure. We're running a little bit low on elementary and high school, so we'll need to figure out where we're going to be putting those. And where are the demands and stuff like that. But uh, we got our at least a harbor in and they go directly on. Most of them actually go directly on to the tram line. Um, if we check this tram right now, it's only got five passengers. And then we got 53 of them just got picked up. So pretty much almost most of the passengers are getting directly on here. Some are taking vehicles out. And we do have some actual uh, hotels around here. So we got this hotel here, and that's $50. We're making about 800 in profit from that. And then we got another hotel over here, which we're making about 900 a week in profit from that one. So we're doing pretty good for actual... Um, the hotels and stuff and it's right near a aquarium so it's it's just a really nice area that we designed and um eventually we'll branch off to here we might make a little uh nature reserve or something like that in this area or something we got all this area up here that we can still develop and i also put a, another exit over here just so there's um people able to get off on this side as well so they don't just flood over here because this one started getting a little bit busy but um outside of that if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe comment down below rate the video and i will see you guys next time thanks for watching peace out